Before the session started, some lawmakers wanted to give all New Mexico teachers a 3% raise. The governor wanted to do more and give them 4%, but now teachers could see a 5% hike thanks to a new amended budget that was approved by the House Finance Committee today. The core for education is teachers and we don't want to lose any. Representative Patricia Lundstrom chairs the Finance Committee. We're trying to retain and recruit teachers in this state. You know, we put a big investment into education last last session, and we want to make sure that we keep the momentum up. Analysts are calling the new budget a compromise between the governor's proposal and what some lawmakers want. It will increase state spending by 7 percent. What the governor has been saying since the beginning is that she was aiming for a moonshot. Everything that she put into her initial funding request was more than she sh thought she could probably get. Every Republican on the Finance Committee voted against it. They tell us they plan to propose a different budget this week that would still give teachers raises, but not as much. Throwing money at the problem isn't going to solve it. We need to address the structural real problems with education. There is still a long way to go before the budget makes its way to the governor's desk. It's expected to be voted on in the House this week and will likely see some changes before it goes to the Senate. The governor also wants to pass a bill she says would provide free college education to high school grads here right now. That bill is in the House Education Committee.